Diana, welcome to Brighton and Hove Albion. How does it feel to officially be part of the club? It feels amazing. I was waiting for this for some time already. So it, uh, it's finally nice to be here and be part of the club. To be sat here today, you know, at the training ground and seeing all the facilities, what's it been like for you? How have you felt walking into to the training ground today? Uh, has been uh, amazing uh, when I uh, left the car and went inside. I had the feeling inside my stomach and uh, it was such a nice feeling and uh, I was very proud of myself. And what has the recruitment process been like for you? What were the sort of main draws and pulls to, to make you choose Brighton and Hove Albion? Soon as I heard Brighton, I was like, yeah, that's... I told to my agent, don't tell me anything else. I, I just want that to work, so yeah, for me it's amazing to be part of the league and be here and it's just, I'm so proud. And how much are you looking forward to competing in the WSL week in and week out with the rest of the team? Uh, I'm really excited about it and I would uh, like to see how much I can give and how much I can develop. I'm very excited about the league is very good and well known around and I was very excited to be part of so yeah. It's like you said, it's a very competitive league and mm -hmm. it brings a, a wealth of challenges to mm -hmm. whoever plays in it. Is that something that you embrace and thrive in? Yes, uh, motivates me a lot and um, I can see how much I can yeah, handle the pressure and everything. How would you describe your style of play as a player? I would say I'm very creative. I like to be tough in duels and show toughness on the field and especially passion. I think I have winning winner mentality. So yeah, very emotional on the field and I love winning. So you you can see how much it means to me when I score, when we win. So yeah, very passionate. And it's an exciting time for the club with Jens just coming in as the new head coach. How much are you looking forward to working with him for the remainder of the season and, and the rest of the girls? Uh, I'm very excited about it because I had teammate, I have teammates from national team who played for him, so I only heard the very good things about him, so I'm very excited about that. And I heard he likes winning, so I think we're on the same <laughs> page, yeah. And there's still a lot to play for in the remainder of the season as well. It's quite tight where the, where the team are in the WSL table. Uh, I hope so, we're gonna, um, make a better results from now and uh, I believe with everything we have and with new players and with old players also we can make a good atmosphere, a good team spirit that can make a good results. I believe in that. So coming to Brighton it's almost like a new chapter for yourself at this stage of your career. What is it you're wanting to achieve at your time at the club? I would like to to make the best results we can, from to make many points we can, and try to be at, at uh, the one of the top teams in the league, and that's of course uh, my goal when I came here. And, and coming here as well, how much are you looking forward to sort of immersing yourself here in England and in Brighton and being part of the sort of adjusting to the culture? I'm very excited because I'm coming from. My last club was in Norway, so it was also different culture, different weather and uh, different food. So I'm very excited to explore everything and especially to see how it's mentality in this league and this group, this team. So uh, very excited and curious how it's going to be.